Made it out. Where's he at? I guess we should save, huh? God, it's so many like, save, save, save. Are you sure you want to save? Three. Somewhere. I knew you'd be under the island. I flippin' knew it, dude. They're always under the island. Somewhere I was hoping I'd find you here. I heard you've gone searching for your bird around the waterfall, so I thought I'd fly around and help you look. How's your search going? Any sign of your loft wing? I mean, I don't have them with me, if that's what you're asking. Don't lose hope yet. There's a place up ahead with Grizzly's gang always hanging around. Well, then why wouldn't we look there first? Huh? Who? Who's that? Who's calling for me? Oh, sorry. I got distracted. Um, let's go. <gasps> She's following me around? What are you waiting for? Let's go. Oh my God. This Breath of the Wild too. Look, there he is. Really? You couldn't get out of that? You better be tied down to the back of that wall. That's all I'm saying. You better be chained down in there. If you couldn't get out of that, bro, I swear to God, if this you couldn't get out of this, what kind of bird are you anyway? You're the worst flipping bird. Are you chained to the back of the wall? His name's Tom. Tom? It has to be Tom, right? He wasn't chained to the Tom. Are you kidding? You couldn't get out of the massive gap on top of that? You could have easily fit out of that, Tom. Bro, you're dumb as hell. All right, all right, Tom, calm down. No, no, you need to stay here. I need to use you, so Tom. We should hurry. Now that your loft ring is free, you should be able to fly to the ceremony. Before you go, I have to ask you something. I I heard this voice a few moments ago. I heard it too. The hell are you talking about? It's been happening a lot lately. It's the strangest feeling, almost like going insane. Have you ever wondered what's beneath the clouds? Um probably death. It's an empty, barren place, or even that there's nothing at all below. But I just have this feeling that they're wrong. Some of the father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe a whole world under there, far more vast than the Skyloft. The thing is, no one's ever been down there to see it. And our lawflings won't fly through the cloud barrier. But I can't help imagining the wild things that might be waiting below. Someday I want to see it for myself. I'm saying that too, Novicious. Sorry, Zomar, we should we don't have time to talk. Let's get going. Your bird is waiting for you. Leap off the edge, press down. Don't worry about falling. Your bird will catch you for sure this time. Acting like I've never done this before. <laughs> Haven't I been doing this like my whole entire life? I push down. I think this game will be important to Breath of the Wild too, as well. No vicious. Let's go. Okay, so how do I fly him? Tilt the Joy-Con to turn. Swing it down to gain altitude to speed up. Change X to charge burst speed. You can't move anyway. B to slow down. If you have no speed, you'll stop midair. You can fly a bird in any direction. When it's headed up, slowly you lose speed. Okay. All right. When you want to speed up, drop fast dive. Yeah. So again, altitude. Basis of gliding your bird to get up to top speed. How's he handling? You think he's flying alright? He's not handling very good at all, I'll be honest. I don't know why my camera is like this. Ascend. Why is he going down?
Hello? <laughs> Why won't he go up? He won't go up. 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 Oh! Oh! There we go. You press Y to, to reset the gyro, right? Why does he keep going down? Go up! I got a flap like him? Okay, we're going up now. No, no, no. Don't go down. Don't go down. Don't go down. Keep going up. Up, 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 up. Stop. Okay. Controllers like this. Pointing TV. Push button. Up. There we go. Okay, we're good now. We're good now. B to slow down. Don't slow down. Stop. Stop slowing down. Go forward. Forward. Go. Charge. This is going to be tough. Why does he slow down like that so much? Stop going down. Why does he go down? I'm not pushing B. Like... That's a huge relief. That was... No, he's flying horrific. What do you mean? Worried about it, birds. Let's go give him the good news. He's flying horrifically. Were you guys seeing that? Anyone? No? Your law offering really is amazing. He went down into the clouds. You couldn't even see him anymore. I'm gonna fly back and tell my father what happened. That he went... That I almost died? Oh, well, well, if it isn't some war. Where are all the plazas you found that dumb bird of yours? Well, that's just great because you and your dumb bird can't tell time. All the preamps, warm ups, and the guys were in for nothing. Now I'm all stiff. But I've, we've been waiting forever for the race to start, and they delay it for you. I don't get it. The big flake gets special treatment. <laughs> You're almost a man, and yet you still can't seem to go anywhere without Zelda. I bet you can't even decide what to have for lunch on your own, huh? She does, she does, she does help pick lunch. We go have lunch together. And don't even notice as my oh, Zelda and I are best friends. We go everywhere together. You think you're pretty suave, don't you? Well, don't you? He's just been going on forever about how he's going to be the one to be with Zelda. Really got to have a pompadour and a ruffle about her. <laughs> der, der, her, her, der, her, her, her. I hate to break it to you, but today's the day I bust this adorable little fantasy land you're living in. <laughs> this guy's ridiculous. Zelda's playing the role of the goddess at today's ceremony, and I'm gonna be the one to claim that sailcloth. When I heard she made it herself, man, no way I was gonna let some scrawny clown snatch that prize from me. Oh yes, that sailcloth. That sailcloth will be mine. <laughs> oh man, I bet she was thinking about me when she was stitching it. Yep, I can see it now. First I'll win the big race, and then Zelda and I will finish the ceremony together on that statue. Just the two of us. It'll be our special moment alone. Nobody is stopping me and Zelda from having our moment. Oh, it's so real, I can see it. <laughs> oh yeah. Behind you! Right behind you! What? Can't you two see I'm in the middle of a... God, that's poor Groose, dude. Go! Mm -hmm. <laughs> <sighs> Look for me during the race, I'll be the one pulling off the real dangerous moves. <laughs> it's too ridiculous, dude. Yeah, I think I might switch to the pro controller. I can't control the bird at all. I think it's might be just because I'm sitting like really close to the switch maybe, but I don't know. I know you've got these guys beat and deep down I think you do too. Uh, I don't know honestly because of my controller being very busted. Um, but yeah, no, I got him. That's the spirit. Trust me, you can win this. 
The wing ceremony will now begin. Participating students, please assemble. Looks like it's race time. Good luck, Zomor. A button broken? Pushing it. Nothing's happening. Is this... Maybe this is uh, Emily's Joy-Con. Her Joy-Cons are way more messed up than mine. Cool. I have a sword and they don't. Ha! Huh? Hey. Your attention, please. At last, we are ready to begin the wing ceremony. I was beginning to worry we would have to proceed without Zamwa, but luckily that is no longer a concern. I'm glad you could all make it. Before we start, I'll explain the rules for today's competition. I have attended a small- I have attached a small statuette to this bird, who I will then release into the skies. On my signal, dash from the starting line and dive off the ledge. Once you are in the air, mount your loft ring. Remember to call your bird promptly with down. And whoever catches the bird and claims the statuette will be this year's champion. That's it? Those are the rules. Simple enough. Do I just dive off and grab a statue? Sounds easy enough. Excellent. As you well know, today's champion will graduate to the next class, bringing him one step closer to knighthood. He will also receive a gift from a young woman chosen to play the role of the goddess in the ritual. Today's special day for many reasons, but it's also the 25th anniversary of our fine institution. Wait. Is it... How old is... This is the anniversary edition, right? This is HD edition. Isn't this like an anniversary deal? <laughs> Today's champion shall also receive this gift atop the highest statue of the goddess. It's definitely not 25 years. Oh, I'm really sorry. They didn't say any rules about not using your sword. Clip their wings. Oh my God. As you all well know, the role of the goddess this year will be performed by the lovely Zelda. Okay, guy, let's stop laughing creepily. Let's see your finest flying out there. Let's show how hard you've been practicing. Also, I want to see good, clean filing. Anyone caught interfering with the other riders will answer to me. Oh, there you go. Can't do that. Can't clip their wings. That goes double for you, Groose. Hey. All right, gentlemen, line up at my command. The competition will begin. Hey. Go! Oops. All right, control the bird. I'm trying so hard right now. I need to get higher up. Man, how do I keep going? How do I go higher up? It's so hard to go higher up. Oh, you can, like, flap your wings. Okay. They didn't tell me anything about flapping my wings. Hey, don't you know this is my day to get all the glory? Disqualified. Let's see how you fly with an egg. Where the hell did you get that giant egg? All right, we're going in. Come 
I'm starting to get the controls. Got the bird statue. It proves your victory today. Wait till Zelda sees this. Let's go. <laughs> I didn't notice Groose lost when he has a sick hairdo. <laughs> He's swinging the Joy Cons in a downward motion. Thank you, Sharingan Beast. See, they didn't tell me that. You can go like this to flap your bird's wings, and that's how you get height. So that's why I was falling down into the clouds last time, because I wasn't doing that. Interesting. Maybe they did tell me, maybe I missed it. That's fair enough. I thought I read the controls pretty thoroughly, but dude, Zelda is so fucking, <laughs> she's so excited. <laughs> she's so flippin' excited, dude. My God. You all right there, girl? <laughs> Don't worry, I'm fine. <laughs> Great flying, Zomar, congratulations. And we better get on with the ceremony. Man, this is, uh, seems almost romantic. A romantic term between Link and Zelda that's normally not seen as much. Somewhere, hand me the bird statuette you grabbed in the race. I must offer it to the goddess. Putting it in backwards. Okay, yeah, she's flipping it around. Why wouldn't you just flip it around and then put it in? I don't know. Zelda's weird. Great goddess, guiding light and protector of our people, grant us your blessing and mercy as I act in your stead during this day. Valiant youth who grasped victory at the celebration of bird folk, in accordance with the old ways, I now bestow on you the blessings of the goddess upon you. Oh, I get her shawl? <gasps> that was the thing I thought was cool! Huh! She looks so tiny without it. Blessings of the goddess drift down from the heavens aloft a sail, which I will now pass. Bow, 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 bow! Link's got a like, yeah! <laughs> Without any fear of a painful landing. Hey, no fall damage! Nice, too. What? <laughs> That's like so... They're trying to get them together. I kind of like it though. There's like a romance it thing. I kind of like that. Somewhere, quick goofing. You're supposed to be at a sacred rush. She literally, cause he went like that. <laughs> the game is so aware. I love it. They say the goddess save, gave the sailcloth to her chosen hero long ago. Of course, you're the one holding it the same. The one you're holding isn't the same one. I've been working hard to finish making this sailcloth in time to give it to today's champion. I'm really glad it was you. Make sure you take good care of it, okay? I love how she like emphasized that as like slow talking. This is great. Thanks for making it up here to do this with me today like you promised. I did it. She's so tiny. Her head looks massive now without the sailcloth. I really wish we could finish up this ritual. You do know what happens at the end, right? Nope. I tried to say no. I literally tried to say no. And it said, uh-oh. Because of the motion controls. I need to use the joystick to select stuff, not motion controls. And just what are you thinking? Don't be silly. This is our big moment. What's the big moment? What, are you going to kiss me? You have to jump off the statue! God damn it. <laughs> Look down. See that big brown design on the courtyard below? To finish the ceremony, you need to drop right down into the center of it. Leap off the edge here. Right before you hit the ground, press ZR to open up your sailcloth. 
Just how brave are you? If you were really furious, you'd wait until the last second to use your stale cloth. So you ready? All right, ZR is this one. Last second? All right, she challenged me to do last second. We have to do last second. Oh my god! What is the- what is happening? Why am I going this way? What? what, what why was I going that way? Oh boy, I see you messed up your landing. Yeah, because my guy was going like... <laughs> Tilting your body. All right, yeah, let me try again so that way it's actually like... I didn't, I didn't realize this was happening. Dash off the edge. Yeah, that might help instead of being pushed. Zelda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh my god, I'm so good. So good. That was last second. Oh, wait, what? Oh, the middle of the round design. Okay. That's kind of tougher. Okay. I'm, uh, okay. Okay. <clears throat> Don't worry, Zelda. I got it this time. I'm going to get that kiss. I don't know if I get a kiss. Oh my god, I'm so good. So good. That was definitely last second, but animation of it coming out didn't even happen. <laughs> that was perfect! You're amazing! She called me amazing. Now Keith. Kiff. It's time to kiff. Seeing as you won today. Eh? And with the weather being so nice. Let's go for a let's go for a flight. You think maybe you'd like to, you know, go fly around the cows together? Ooh, like a date? Oh He said yes. My frappuccino's out. I need to make another one. Or just get a soda. Somewhere! Somewhere! The day was amazing! Watching you win the race and performing the ritual together. I'll always remember this. Really was wonderful. You know, Zomor. There's something I've been meaning to talk to you about. Her eyes are fluttering. In traditional fashion, Ganondorf being a, a, a blocker, a C block. Oh my god, it's like a tornado. What's going on? Ah, Zumwar. Dang it, Tom. You couldn't dive faster? Oh, he's gonna catch me now. Good job, Tom. Maybe this Tom I'll actually get along with. Okay, maybe he's not gonna catch me. Zumwar. Oh, that's right. I have been hearing voices. Maybe I should have told Zelda that. I forgot. I just thought it was a dream, though. The goddess? I am waiting for you. The time has come for you to awaken. You are vital to a mission of great importance. I can only talk to you in dreams, so please. What? Zelda? What? Why is my, my controllers vibrating? Wait, she's falling. Yeah, that would be a spooky dream. You're awake. When your loftwing carried you back, you were limp and unconscious. I feared the worst. Fortunately, you don't appear to have many serious injuries. For that, I am grateful. But somewhere, where's Zelda? She was with you, was she not? What's happened to my daughter? Oh, I'm talking.
So she was about to kiss me, right? And then out of nowhere, tornado, man. No, it was brown. It wasn't really black, but I mean, that's kind of semantics, I guess. That is no ordinary storm. I love how I gave Link like a New Yorker accent. No, that's just my accent. I'm going to save her. You must not push yourself. You're still recovering. Tell me, when you saw Zelda today, did you... Anything about her seem off? Yeah, she's been hearing voices, but so have I. Goddess, you know, in the dream, telling us to do stuff. I see. She was talking about the surface then. I mean, I didn't mention the surface. <sighs> Sorry, guys, I need my water. My throat's starting to get real dry. And you've been having dreams about a great mission. How interesting. I'm sorry, I was lost in thought there for a moment. All very strange, but I doubt there's much connection between these things. I'm concerned for Zelda, so as long as she's with her Loftwing, I'm sure she'll be fine. Either way, Daybreak has yet to arrive. It would be very difficult for her spot one girl and her bird in the dark of night. It would also be very dangerous. Sleep until the morning, Link. Though I know you probably won't. Sounds like Midna. Come here. I'm actually slower when I roll. <sighs> Watch your footing out there. In the dark, you'll never may I may, may take a step on the ledge. Don't catch me flying out. Only trained knights such as myself can be doing that. Take care now. I forgot you run up walls. I was just trying to sprint and get the fruit. That's, um... So did he... Did this guy happen to see, you know... The girl? Like, right here? Like... That's canon. <laughs> yeah, that is... That is that is the canon some way now. Come back here. Momo. Hmm. I'm trying to help it. Oh. I don't want to kill Momo. What am I swinging a sword at a freaking cat for? Aw, poor little thing. Oh! Oh, God! Alright, so Momo just led me to a red ruby. Nice.
I can't swing my sword at all when my stamina is down. That's actually insane. Okay, so I got to be careful about doing this then. So pokes don't work again, Tim. That's actually kind of cool. Where did she go? Where did she go? I pushed down. God. Stop right there, criminal scum. Watch your footing out there. In the dark, you'll never know what might take a wrong step off a ledge. Oh, and don't let me go catch you flying out at night. Only trained knights such as myself should be doing that. You take care now. I always go to Skyrim Guard. Or Oblivion Guard. Alright, so jump off and call my bird. So I guess he would probably hear me whistle too. So maybe I'm not supposed to do that. Maybe I'm supposed to climb the vines that are right behind me. That might be what I need to do. But we're not going to do that. You know why? Because we're already at the 30-minute mark. And that's going to be the end of the third episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Really appreciate you watching. And uh, see you in the next one.